Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to take this design and put it on a canvas. So what I did was I pulled up this design. It had all these little hearts all over it and I added all of the grandbaby's names. So now I want it to print or rather cut. I want it to cut all of this in one color. So I'm going to go down here and I'm going to click attach. Now what that is going to do is that's going to attach all of this design together. So now that we have it all together as one, I'm going to click over here and click make it. And this is going to be cut on um, heat transfer vinyl. Okay, so now what it's doing is it's determining how many different colors I have and how many mats I need. And since I'm printing it all in one color, I'm going to go over here and click mirror because we're using the heat transfer vinyl. If you were putting it on permanent vinyl, you would not need to mirror it. So then we're going to click continue. And make sure all of our settings are on. It says make sure mirror is turned on for iron-on. We have done that. And now we're going to go to our machine and we're going to cut it. And now that you have the design cut out, now you're going to do what's called weeding, which is removing the excess vinyl. away from your design. want to go in and remove all the little pieces that didn't come off with the big piece and I'll do this and then we'll be right back okay so now we have um, preheated this canvas um, if you go to www.cricut.com um, it will tell you to preheat the canvas at 300 degrees for five seconds we've already done that now we have taped down the design with um, heat resistant tape. So now um, we are going to heat press it at 300 degrees for 15 seconds. Um, if that doesn't work, we're gonna do it again. So let's go ahead and start. And since this design is so big, we're gonna have to do it in sections. Okay, so let me do this a couple more times and we'll be right back. Okay, so I did each section four times at 300 degrees for 15 seconds. Um, I also forgot to tell you that I put a towel underneath so I would move the canvas from here to here so that there was something hard behind it for the maximum amount of pressure. 
So let's see if it's stuck. Oh, and there we go. It worked perfectly. And so this is the final. Oh, I gotta have it in the camera for you to see it. So now I'm going to paint um, a few little red hearts on here um, just for embellishments, but it works. You can use, um, this was iron on vinyl and you just cut it out on the Cricut and put it on here and do it for 300 degrees for 15 seconds. Um, I did, again, I did each section four times because I just wanted to make sure I had enough pressure on it and that all these little letters that they stuck. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and let me know down in the comments what other items or designs or projects you would like to see me do next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.